Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today is episode number 5 of my Leeds United career mode here today on FIFA 16. Hopefully everything looks better. My face should look pretty much the same but the gameplay should be much less crappy. I was basically using OBS to record everything, the gameplay and the webcam and it, for some reason the old guy when it goes into OBS, <coughs> excuse me, there's something about it that the Elgato transmits like a lower quality stream to get it there faster, something like that. So I decided to use the Elgato software. I asked Chesnoy Gaming on Twitter because he's someone that I thought used it to record everything to ask him about settings and stuff. But it turns out he uses the Elgato to record the gameplay, which is what I'm doing, and then using the webcam in OBS. So hopefully everything should be good. We're not getting any lag. We're not dropping any frames. We should be good. So hopefully today, guys, everything will look better. But we have got this game against QPR. We're going to go and jump straight on into it, and I'm hoping to pick up three points straight away. also want to point out, guys, my hair is bad. This side of my head today just doesn't want to stay flat, so it looks kind of funky in the camera. But um, I can't see it, because when I look over, the camera's that way. So, yeah, but I'm sorry if my hair or whatever looks a bit funky today. That is simply why we're recording, we're recording. Just making sure everything is good, because this is how I want to record videos from now on. But... QPR is going to be a difficult game. I'm hoping for three points here today at, um, I can't even think of their name, the, the name of their stadium now, just completely gone. But yeah, hopefully today we can pick up three points. So let's get into it and see what we can do, guys. Oh, God, they're already on the run. Surely that's offside. Blindsman. Oh, my God, guys, we nearly conceded instantly. That would have been horrific. Oh, go on, Carriol's got it here. Is that small side, is it? Doesn't look like it. Look for cross. Oh, Lewis Cook. He got taken down there. Nothing's going to come of it, though, because it wasn't a foul. But let's try and whip it in from this corner here. Oh, it's come to Aya Hanacho. What a goal from Aya Hanacho. Didn't expect that to actually go in, but it did anyway, which is absolutely fantastic. And we are 1 0 up against QPR already. I mean, look at that. It was quite lucky. It came to me, just banged it. Fantastic strike past Robert Green there. We've got a corner here. We'll try and do something similar. We just whip it out to here. Put it down. Sloth takes a shot. Sloth scores a splendid goal there. Wow. We're going to break again here. Phillips on the right hand side. Is he going to get a cross in? Hopefully he isn't. He is going to get a cross in. Decent cross and a decent save from our goalkeeper, Silvestri. Good header there, Bosuki Murphy into Lewis Kirk. Try and thread it out to the wing. We have eventually got it out to the wing. Carrier, what can he do with it? We'll try the Berber spin. Oh, he's gone down. Nothing's going to come of it, I don't think. I oh, actually has got it back. Whip it in, boy. Oh, that was close. Oh, God. QPR are through here with Poulter. They take the shot. Good save from Silvestri. He hasn't had too much to do today. When we need him, he seems to be doing very well. Oh, lovely bit of play here. Sloth again. Getting involved so much. I don't know who this guy is, but he is a tank. That's all I'm going to tell you. Carry all for three. Carry all for free. Carry all for free. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't ever do that again. That was awful. That was actually tragic. But anyway, um, we are now 3 nil up. Lovely bit of play there. Threads it through. Carry all through with a load of room and just fires it past Robert Green. Easy as you like. Got Erwin loose here. I'm actually going to try something really audacious. Holy shit! What? What just happened? Oh my god! How on earth did he score that? That is insane! Surely not for five. Oh my god, Rod Green actually pulls off a splendid save there, but Tarka. Took one hell of a hit with that, and I mean, almost went in. To be fair, it was it was heading in, and he got a hand to it. That is the end of the game, guys. We pick up a four-nil victory. Absolutely delighted with that. Great performance by the team. Right, guys, we are back in the screens. We're going to do a little bit of training here. See what the players can do. Really happy so far that we're finally starting to pick up some form. Pe Peacock Farrell, the goalkeeper, has gone up to 59. That's good. Every other player seems to be doing okay, which again is good. I might actually do some of the player training one day, actually do the skill games, I don't know. We got in at Southampton though. This could be interesting today. I don't know if we're gonna what we're gonna do. This will be our first real test of BPL opposition and what we can do against a BPL team. So 
I mean, we're at home, so there is a chance we could beat Southampton today, although I don't think it'll be in our favour, but you never know, we can beat them, and that's the positive attitude we've got to maintain. Let me just check the calendar. Where is the calendar? There's the calendar. So we've got a game against Bristol City, I think that is. Um, I might actually play that game as well. I might do a three-game episode today. We'll see how we get on. Right, guys, into the game we go. I'm nervous for this one. It's Capital One Cup fixture, so this is a competition we could try and win. And we'll see if we can beat Southampton today. I, I think we can, but I don't know. They are a really good team, and their players are definitely much better than ours. So it's a real test, though, to see how we may get on next season, because this is the sort of team like, I'd expect to be as good as Southampton next season if we get to BPL straight away. So it's going to be interesting to see how we fare. And they've started off well here, and it's not looking good already. Cedric's got the ball. Well, we need to play better. Wanyama, we've managed to clear. No, we haven't. It's gone straight through to Cedric, and he's almost put them 1-0 in front. Southampton through again. Jay Rodriguez, we've managed to tackle him, though. Oh, no, he's got it back. Oh, shit. Into Shane Long. Good save. Please, please. Oh, oh my God. And Janami there. Janami. Can we do a bit of skill? Oh, my God. He's done a... I can't remember what that's what called. Oh, my God. Oh my god, that is stunning from Bataka to put us 1-0 in the lead. Didn't expect that. He did, um, I think it was an Elastico though, a double Elastico, something like that. And a lovely roulette as well. Guy goes in for a tackle a bit too late and he just finishes it easily with his left foot. He's a fantastic player. I absolutely love Bataka. 1-0 to us. Fantastic start. Bataka again on the wings. This time we do the Balassi flick. And the normal Berber spin, that doesn't work that time, unfortunately. Oh, we've given it away. No, 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 no. Where's my defenders gone? I don't know. And we're in serious trouble here because Shane Long, oh, he's got too much pace. Too much pace. Oh, good save. Good save. Good tackle. And there we go. I think we've managed to clear it away. We have done. All right, Hanacho, waiting for that run from Bataka. Over the top. Bataka's through. Can he do anything with it? Oh, he nearly skinned him there. I don't know what that was attempting to be, but okay. Shane Long, he's going to cross it in. Oh, God. Last five minutes here, guys. These are going to be really scary because we are so close to conceding. Good luck to Murphy. Oh, my God. What happened there? We've got a free kick, guys. This could be a chance to maybe make it two. I don't know if it will. I'm going to back as well. That's maybe annoying midway through it. A video, especially with the face cam on as well. But um, so I guess Aya Nacho here could score an absolute belter of a goal. Oh, he, he came close. I've been practicing free kicks, as I mentioned, and that was close. But that, guys, is a 1 0 victory over Southampton. Not really anything too crazy. I, I don't think we really deserve to win that game, but we did. That's what happens in FIFA sometimes. And yeah, we've got a win. I thought the Capital One Cup had two legs to it. Maybe I, I must be wrong then. We are in fourth in the lead though. We're going to sim this game against Bristol City, see how we go. Um, so, yeah, we, I mean, we're already into nearly October, which is fantastic. So, I really want to, as I said, get this series like going quickly. I don't want to just be hanging around on episodes because I feel like in my other series, sometimes it can feel like the season takes forever. So, we sim this, we get a one all draw, which isn't too bad considering. And we're into October, which is awesome. And we are still in fourth place. It's quite tight at the top. Obviously, we're only 10 games in. In the next episode, guys, we have a game against... I'm not going to pretend that I know who that team is. Huddersfield, of course. I knew that all along. Um, definitely not. But we got suspension. Paluski's got a one-match ban. That's annoying, but not the end of the world. And we've got some players leaving on international duty. So that, guys is the end of today's episode. Who's the player of the month? The player of the month was Middlesbrough Rhodes. Good congratulations to him. But currently, the league table is looking something like this. Middlesbrough already five points clear. What? They haven't lost a game yet, so that could be interesting. We want to try and fight for that second spot. I mean, if we win our next game and the other two teams lose, we go top. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed. If everything looks better, let me know. It should be good. I mean, on my screen, everything looks good so i'm hoping that it's the same for you guys watching as well have a great rest of your day if you can smash over five likes on this video that'd be absolutely awesome if you haven't already please do go and drop a subscription to the channel it is greatly appreciated and i'll speak to you guys in the next video very soon peace